All right, guys, we're back in Minecraft today. I am, or uh, uh, I uh, recorded some footage. Uh, I've recorded footage before this, so I've been back on for about two days now. But there was no audio in it. I had my mic in, but the setting wasn't on to in, to take audio in, so that sucks. But yeah, okay. So we got two worlds. So this is gonna be my first video. The other footage I deleted already, so that sucks. All right, so let me go through this again. It's gonna be annoying. So that sucks, okay? So, uh, in the first supposed to be episode, I was just showing off the land and like showing off the plans for this place. But now I'm just going to show off what I have so far. Okay. So I spawned over that way on these, this little shelf right here. This little plain shelf that my brother did that in here. I don't know why. We spawned in this area. Mm, from where I'm standing, it's Friday. Okay, so already we've got a couple towers around. But this is the first one that I'm going to show you. This one's the first one, so. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we got that and that. What? Why is. Why is it so low? What? Yeah. Okay, yeah, we need to completely redo the stairs. Everything. We need to do, redo the interior entirely. Do that. Oh, my bestie. Alright, so, that was my bestie, Shadow Cat. We know each other in reality. Uh, we know each other in the real world, and we play for played Fortnite a little bit. Seriously? You're gonna do that to me? Good. We don't have ladders. Damn. Mm -hmm. My bestie shut up. My best friend in the whole world. Okay, so yeah, we fixed this one up because the other ones had the same building uh, structures and what not. Oh, we also need lantern. No, we don't need lantern. We need. Oh. This and this. Right there. Bam. Keep the lights on. Take that out. You just put one torch right there. Right there. Yeah, good. Good. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now we got that fixed. Let me tour you. Okay, so we got a little river right here. And guess what? It leads all the way out to the bay. It's awesome. I'm definitely going to cut or even do a time loop right here. Ready, set, now. And also, it's got these weird little, like, bends in it. Like, these little things right here, that happens in actual life. It does have a few uh, pillager areas along it. 
Was it there? Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Here. Was that one that I? Oh yeah. There's this right here, which is really cool. I discovered it one day when I was like up there on that hill. And I was like looking over and like, oh, that's so cool. So yeah, they built on the water. It's really cool. Got this massive ravine. Quick tip guys, never do amplified worlds because then you'll have massive mountains. Like, and the mountains are like only for, like the only almost level land. It's not like ground level, but like it almost is. So yeah, we got these little cool little bands. We got, ooh, it's a pyramid, a pyramid, temple. We got that, got little sand village right there. And we got this little village too. So that's gonna be great for trade. And we got this weird thing. Probably gonna build something right there. So yeah, this thing leads all the way out into the bay and the ocean. But my map doesn't encompass that, so sucks. I'm gonna do it. Do a speed right here. Go. Also, it's got a lot of great plains and flat land around it, so that's really cool. That's a cool mountain. Might build a little, little, little base right there. And we have this thing. I'm gonna burn it down eventually. I don't, cause I don't know the range of effect that it has. Like my base could be on this mountain and it's over there, and I don't know uh, how wide its range of effect is. Okay, so we're back here. My mom was being annoying. So I built a bridge. That was like the first thing I did. And we built some uh, towers. These are the watchtowers, okay? Really good design. I love the design I have on them. We gotta have towers all over the place. Make sure that no bad things come and kill us. I'll show you that tower in a sec. Planning on having a tower either right here or down there. For reasons. Uh, yeah. Once I put one right somewhere on here, then I think the mostly the whole mountain would be okay. Might put it. Might put one right here just to survey the bridge. This will probably just be a quick little easy surveillance spot. Probably not going to be super big. Probably going to be smaller. Okay, so uh, this one, this one's special, but and I'm gonna show you why in just a moment. So you go in, this should be on at all times. Go up, hold up, actually. First thing you walk in, first thing when you walk in is you'll notice that there's that, the lamp, the bed, and then a ladder and a trap door in the wall so you go down here you spin and get dizzy if you want you don't have to get stuck and then you arrive here in the hangar area where you will be deployed as air support this little it was supposed to be an arrow so in here is weapons glider is elytras uh iron swords and crossbows uh, two rows of each, two rows of each. And here is three rows of arrows, a row of mutton, chicken, and steak. So yeah, and then up here it says deploy, deploy, go, go, deploy, deploy, go, go, defend the mountain. Okay, and then so you come out here, eh. And then you go to wherever the guy who was sent said. Now, of course, this is going to be a very large scale, uh, going to be a very large fortress. So, I'm going to try and see if anyone wants to play it with me. Maybe Janman. 
Yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right. I'll probably get Jan Man to play with me. Uh, maybe Fortnite and COD. Maybe even, I don't know, Nation. I'll, I know all of their real names, by the way. But, uh, don't really want to just do that like that. Uh, Fortnite and Fun has a Fortnite. Fortnite card has, and I don't know the nation don't have I mean they have a channel they both have a channel link is on my channel page if you go look at it so what to do in this episode this is the introduction video because my old footage didn't have any actually before I was even planning on putting a tower here and here and then controlling the entire mountain like this mountain right here, the ravine in it, it's an entire mountain pass, okay? So like you can either go up the mountain, like if you wanna pass through, you can either go o over the mountain or you can just go through the mountain, through the ravine. And you'll be out on the other side in no time. So I, Plan on controlling that entire mountain pass. This is the easy, this is a mountain pass that'll be easy to do. I, when I play Minecraft, I always look at it from a perspective as if, like it was real world, like ta real world tactics. I always think of it that way. That's how I always think of stuff, most of the time. Here's gonna be a marketplace. It, yeah, here's gonna be a little marketplace. A little villa, maybe even some normal houses. Uh, where was it? Oh yeah, here is the pit of shame, the prison hole. And over here, there's a little secret entrance. I found this, this is like real uh, natural made. So that's real cool, this is real. And natural, but it does lead out to the side of the mount. It does only lead out to the side of the ravine. And yes, I did put that frame there. That's natural. That's me. Of course, this was covered up, and I'm planning on covering it up. So the point of this thing is, even if you do find this little secret entrance, well then, guess what? You uh, you're not getting out. If you do happen to land in there, which you should, kind of expect you to, because, uh, guess what, my nation is not going to have any mercy. We're not just going to kill you automatically, we're going to throw you in hell and let you rot away. Okay, we don't give you a quick and easy death, we want you to suffer for all the crimes you've committed. This is a cute little divot. Oh, what is in here? Yeah, I did light this up. Oh yeah, this is a little cute little cave that I've discovered. There's actually a few cute little caves. I don't know how many there are overall in this mountain, but plan on discovering that information. So yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do right now. Maybe I'll. Oh, I do need one right here. I'm gonna need one. Probably on top of this. I was planning, I was thinking about on here, but no, that'd be too much work on the bridge. Maybe it'll just be a tiny little. Oh, that, that, that's not gonna have any use. I wanna use it, but. It's not gonna have use. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get started on this next one. We don't need oak wood slabs. So we're gonna pick it up and throw it over the edge. Oh, actually, hold up, is there anything over here? Uh, no. This side is relatively vulnerable. Need a 
Maybe we don't. I don't, I don't know. We're still sort of in the... We're basically in the figure it out stage of this massive fortress that we will have in the end. Now, do be warned, even though they look like a uh, prison uh, out tower, outpost, whatever, they are not. This is a safe place, and we just want to keep it safe. This is going to be a safe place. We can throw the mountain pass, of course. So, one, two, three, yeah. I think I might have built it a little high. Two, three, four, five. Not. Alright. Alright, so we did it. Um that'll be easy to edit because I'll only use maybe a speed loop or a speed timer or whatever. And um that's the end of the episode. If you wanna go back and watch the procedure on how I build this, then sure, whatever. I may even leave it in the link. In the description. I don't know. Probably not. You could just watch it and see how I do it. It's easier. I am gonna uh, fix this one because I did notice that there was a flaw with it when building the last one. Oh, also, I need to. Oh, I did too? Okay. Makes sense. Yep. Yep. Uh, there we go. gonna do that that's mine I like to build it out of wood I'll do the corners do the corners with uh, stone and do the yeah do it like that it's actually very easy to remember how to do ooh this one needs uh, some light oh. This one's all wanked up. Good.
There we go. Good. Okay. Good. Good, good. So yeah, we got uh, one, two, three, four, five towers so far. We'll need one, we, we might need one more. This is gonna be the main, uh, I need to figure out where I wanna put my house. I'll probably put my house up here. Like, level that out and put it there. Probably put another house over here on the cliff. Maybe a small, small house in this spot. Yeah, that looks good. And then down here they could have their little uh, good cave. Maybe a tiny one. So yeah, we're still in the planning phase. We'll need one right here. Maybe a little tiny, tiny, tiny one right here. With only four square uh, standing room. That's gonna be real tiny. Oh, it's gonna be hard to do. Anyway, that's the end of the video. Uh, be sure to leave a like. Be sure to like, leave a comment, subscribe, and hit the bell when you subscribe. And have a fantastical day. I'm gonna do some more work without recording it. And next time you see me, I may be dressed as a king, because before I was just, I was skinned as a castaway, because I only had one structure, and uh, now I'm a guard, because I guard these tower, I, these, this land. Yeah, this is going to take a while to do, maybe not that long, maybe just a week or two, but it's going to be good in the end, it's going to be great. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Actually, I just had a plan. Maybe we can put like a little gate right here, like a little redstone gate with some pu pu uh, with some pistons, and this will be like, yeah, that's a great idea. Oh, what's this area? Did I see? Maybe I did. I don't know. Yeah, this might be just like a little area with a couple of very small houses. And then we might have like a little wall and do like a. A redstone piston gate right there that'd be a great idea so yeah, see you in the video should sure leave a like should sure press the like button you should sure leave a comment subscribe and when you subscribe hit the bell bye and and have a fantastical day bye bye